Flush with cash because he's running a fine wine fraud, John Fox moves into a $2.3 million mansion in Alamo, California, a suburb east of San Francisco. It's a very exclusive community, a very beautiful community. He and his wife bought a house there. He had memberships in two private golf courses. Uh, he paid for his daughter's college tuition with money that he stole from Premier Group clients. And of course, he had quite a collection of fine cars. Very fancy cars, Ferraris, Maseratis, multiple Mercedes. You know, he rarely kept a car for more than a year always trading in for a, a new souped-up muscle car or a new Italian sports car. In Bohemian Berkeley, with a car of choice is more like a Toyota Prius, Fox's flashiness stands out. Melissa Smith, who works in sales for Premier Crew, says Fox's employees take note and give their boss a thumbs down. He would always park halfway between the only handicap space and the spot next to it every single day, backed into it. It drove me insane. There are several times I thought about calling like the local police department just to have it ticketed or towed. Fox lives like he has the world on a string. An all-new American Greed, Mondays, 10 Eastern, CNBC. Get yours. Hey, CNBC fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Here you'll find videos from all your favorite CNBC shows. Be sure to subscribe by clicking right here. Click on the videos around me and watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.